everyone good morning from uh, japan it is i fan vans and uh, i just downloaded a new game and i'm gonna play this game i just saw it on steam like literally 15 20 minutes ago and i'm making an episode it's called satisfactory and it is uh, early access is what it's saying um let's see you will experience bugs crashes visual and performance issues all the good stuff we would really appreciate your honest feedback okay so there, you know it's basically i think it's around 30 dollars um definitely is when you convert it to yen mm, but that's okay because i got a fresh cafe latte here all right, so we're playing multiplayer. Okay, uh, I don't really play multiplayer because I live in Japan and nobody I know over here plays games, so yeah. So it's called Satisfactory and I watched like a little uh, video of it. Here is a, a dude, I think that's that's me uh, probably with a with a mug. That's that's how I look. That's that's pretty much how I look, especially in the winter at least, you know. And uh, basically what it is, whoa. Wait, it's drinking through the helmet. Oh my god, that, that, that doesn't look like it has any drinkability. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Uh, that's actually really funny. Yeah, just keep that in there. You don't need to change it. So the game's been in development, it said, it said, since 2016, and uh, it's ready for early access. I don't know anything about the game other than you're on a plant. There's, there's planets. I don't know how many planets there are. Maybe there's only one planet, but we're on a planet, and... We're there to harvest the planet of its resources for some reason and probably ship it somewhere. It's basically a terrible thing. Um, it's like a Nazi space program where they just go around and like harvest planets and kill off the local populations, wildlife, and just dominate for industry and basically money. But anyways, maybe none of that um, is in the game, maybe it's just for there and, you know, do it, having a good time, right? So, uh, let's get into it, um, <laughs> so the game's been out for about three weeks now, the early access has been out for three weeks, um, the sound in my headphones is a bit loud, so I might, hold on, let me see if I can, audio, there we go, let me turn the music down just a little bit, enable directional subtitles, all right, let me go through the controls real fast. Uh, there's an arachnophobia mode. <laughs> That's the first time I've ever seen that in a gameplay setting. A arachnophobia mode? So, what? That Does that mean there's a bunch of spiders, and if I don't like spiders, I should click arachnophobia mode? Or, if I want to be inundated in spiders, should I click that? I don't know. Uh, I really don't like spiders, that's for sure, but I'm not like terribly arachnophobic or anything, so, um... Alright, let's get into the game. Whoa! Okay, so we have suitable for first-time pioneers, a rocky desert. Ooh, look at that. Dune Desert, recommended for advanced pioneers. Oh no, I want to go to here. I'm not advanced, probably in the slightest. Is that mic too close? Sorry. Initially considered too risky, further investigation has convinced us that this area is visible, viable, sorry, for building with its large open spaces and plentiful mining locations, foliage and water locations are rare and contained, making initial power setups challenging. I used to set up power before, and the controls are kind of similar to ARC. More experienced first timers, ideal for law, first person, first time pioneers. Cafe Latte. <laughs> Alright, so there we go. We're gonna go for the desert. We're, we're, it'll be fine. It'll be fine, I'm sure. Failed to create online session. Press confirm to create an offline session. You'll need to re-host the same game session from the main menu for your friends to be able to join you. I don't have any friends! Whoa! Okay. Oh, we're in space. Sweet. Oh, I love space games. This is why I, I, I downloaded this so fast. It's kind of like... 
Attention Hello. pioneer. Building adventure the following instructional video is a summary of your man. impending duties as an exoplanetary pioneer for Fixit Incorporated. I uh, hope that's not too loud. Fixit pioneers have three cyclical assigned pillars of work to ultimately accomplish project assembly. Use provided blueprints Whoa. to build the necessary buildings. Uh huh. I gotta pay Shout attention the planet to this. and gather resources to provide desired results and improve your infrastructure. A Make sure to report any unusual discoveries to R and D for analysis. Uh, research and development doesn't need to know about any of that. But keep it to Expanded myself. Expanded factories, <laughs> outposts, and pipelines through automation and augmentation. Well, naturally, yeah. That's it. Get to work and be effective. Basically, uglify the pristine Morning. environment. Planetfall imminent. Please remain seated during full procedure. Atmospheric entry in five, four, oh, three, two, okay, we're getting go. One. Okay, that was helpful. That was useful. Oh, I'm on fire! No, no, I'm gonna be cooked. I'm gonna be cooked before I get to the desert. Well, there's my little gun tool, light tool thing. I can't look around very much, but uh, yeah, pretty good um, graphical quality here, man. That's that's like really good. Alright, this entry can take a little while, so just uh, sit back, relax, don't pull on that thing yet. It's like a Disneyland or, or, a, or like a Six Flags Magic Mountain ride, look at me holding on to the steel bar. Whoa, there we are, we can see the outside, oh that is so cool, it's a strange world. Planetfall complete. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna have to Please check the recording the back for the sound the uh, balance here. Suit is at 100%. All right, 100% on oh, my suit. Uh, push it open. Remember, efficiency first. Godspeed. Oh, look at that. That's that's already dirty. Sweet. Whoa, that's so cool. Whoa, that is awesome. I've landed Welcome in this to tiny Planet thing. Massage That's 2 tiny. ABB, your designated sector in the binary star system of Akicha. Oh, a binary star system I of am Akicha. Ada, also known as Artificial Directory and Assistant. Oh, it's tasked always to called support Ada, pioneers, or Ada. Such as you in their mission. You are the third of your sector to survive Planetfall. Congratulations. I survived. We can we're congratulated. Note. Congratulate objective based survival. introduction initialized. Welcome to onboarding. Onboarding? What's that? First objective. Please dismantle the drop pod. The resulting materials will be repurposed to construct a habitat and utility base from now on referred to as the hub. The hub? You can't go. Note. Fix it it's an AI is, is naming things, no. We do not waste. Oh, check out that. There's the other planet. Did they say, did they say binary planet or binary star? Okay, um, let me check sound. All right, all right. It was a little bit loud, I, I, I feel like. I, I think the entry was, it was supposed to be loud, and, and it was a bit loud. Uh, but yeah, I turned the game master volume down by about 10%, and I think we're good. So, right. Uh, press F to enter dismantle mode. Hold the left mouse button to dismantle while in dismantle mode. Oh, that's cool. Oh, man, did you see that flip? Jesus. Graphical quality is really nice. Look at the textures and everything. Um, so I can just dismantle the whole thing. Oh my god, that was that was a bit. Uh, there was no climax there. It's just it's just disappeared. Um, hold. Close. Close right mouse button. So I can... All important fix-it data and communication is recorded and stored in the codex, including these steps. Oh, I know the codex button is X, isn't it? Uh, I think that's it. Parts, equipment, buildings, or maybe, maybe that's the codex? Uh, let me see, I... I was... Second objective. Please oh. ensure you have your Fixit Incorporated Xeno Zapper equipped before leaving the drop zone. Oh, okay. What's Note, that? 
According to Fixit regulations every pioneer should have access to a means of defense against extraterrestrial threats. All right. Okay, so this is my menu. Hold on. Uh, stop talking, Ada. I need to... Okay, the first time was like weird. That took took a little while to... Okay, there's my Zeno Zapper. Standard issue electroshock self-defense weapon for melee range. Excellent. Standard... Standard recipe, okay, so I can make one. Hub parts. Okay, I have hub parts. The, the parts required to build the basic structure of the hub. Okay, that's not the Zeno Zapper. I need... <laughs> I don't know. Oh, wait. Drag and drop equipment into the hands slot to equip it. Further instructions on how to use the inventory are listed below. Oh! Oh, gotcha. Okay, so I can put this on my hand. Right. Oh my god. Third objective. Please familiarize yourself with the resource scanner to find iron. The resource Note, scanner? The acquisition of iron Sounds is good. considered essential in preparation for all future objectives. Yeah, I suppose it is. Okay, there's my sprint. Oh! Whoa, look at the gravity! Oh, that's cool. It's like uh, probably about uh, 70, 80% gravity. Ooh. Oh, that's, that's, that's something dangerous over there. Should we fight it? Uh, press V to... S wait, find and collect. Press V. Scan for iron nodes. V. The location of scanned resources nodes will appear on the HUD and compass. Oh, okay. Oh, I kind of have to... Huh? Oh, it's... If you press it the first time, it like... There's a... It doesn't work, but if you press it the second time, it works. Okay, right. And if you hold it, I can scan for uh, iron ore, I guess. Do you see any? Oh, there's some iron ore right over there. Oh my god, where'd that dude go? Holy moly. Oh, there he is. We're just gonna zap this guy and we're gonna, we're gonna have to get this iron ore here. Ugh. Oh! <laughs> oh! He's running away! <laughs> Dude, that was like a... It was like an alien lion or something. Right, press and hold R to pick up iron ore. Oh my god, I'm chipping it with it. What's with all the technology? I just whip out a chisel. <laughs> Build the house. Note. To complete this objective, the resources salvaged from the draw pod will be consumed. Okay. Yeah. Caution. Oh, Ensure there's the another hub one. is built on spacious open terrain close oh. to the presence of iron sources. Failure to do so will likely result in non-optimal progress. Look at this water over here, I think. Non-optimal progress uh, near iron nodes. Okay, well, I think water is more important, isn't it? Oh, this is a cave right here. I guess this is where everybody builds the base, since the spawn location is like right over there. Ooh, I can harvest. <laughs> I need a better tool for this. Hold on, I think I need a cafe latte as well. Oh, I can. Oh, pick up some leaves. Look at that. Oh man, wait. Let's punch a tree. It's like a survival game. It's. Ooh, what is that? There's another lion thing, but that's okay. They run away. And there's like a glowy crystal in there. We'll probably die, but... It's like a survival game. I haven't punched a tree yet. Uh, oh, I can't. I can just pick up the leaves around it. Oh, let's tidy up around here. Are these... Are these... Gardenous leafy things, you know? That's... That's, that's not... That's not the industrial way. We shall transform this pristine environment into one of oily things and noisy things and and things that operate on fuels and electricities and metal. <laughs> oh, what is that? It's like a... Look at that. It's like a weird glowing grub or something. Oh, there's something big back there. What is that? Is that what I'm seeing? Wait, did I just see something huge back there? Let me jump into the strange water. Is it water? Can I drink it? 
How, by the way, how do I drink? Uh, Q. Oh, that's the builder. Okay. B. B is a. Uh, oh, B is like a headlight on my face or something. Yeah, there is a big thing over there. Oh, it's one of those. Holy moly! Might have to scare this guy off. It's a jump attack! Oh no! No! No, no! He's running around! <laughs> jump! Oh no! <laughs> He's angry! He's really angry! I'm gonna climb up here! Ah! Oh, we survived! He didn't like that. Okay, so you gotta you gotta do it like we did the first time. Oh, oh man, that was kind of scary. Does it, does it tell? We got some kind of damage. Where'd he go? Oh no, I can't whack him again. Press R to pick up green power slug. Do I want to pick this green power slug up? How would I even know it's called the green power slug? I'm collecting a green power slug. Oh, it's... There it goes. I have it. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. He's still pretty angry. Uh, yeah. Probably shouldn't have done that. Okay. You live, you learn. Should we go and zap this big guy? Okay. So, we got to build the hub. Uh, right. So, let me go over here. Uh, might as well build the hub in... Uh, Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh no! That thing exploded and there's a bunch of bees coming after me. Oh no, I think I'm being killed. Oh no, I can't get away from bees. Oh, there's something over there. It looks horny. <laughs> run. I don't know what to do other than run. Oh, they're still following me because they're bees. Yes, into the canyon. Into the canyon. This is a dangerous place, I feel. Yeah, everybody wants to be in this dangerous place. Ugh. There we go. Whoa! No! Oh, I got one! Ugh. Oh! Oh, we got it! Wait, where's the other one? Come on. Oh, I punched it! Is that like a kill move? Whoa! Yeah, how about in here? How about a, how about a base right in... Here. It's kind of dark though. Let's see if we can go up. I feel like it's better to go up. Do I have like a hunger thirst meter? I can. Oh, I can get in pure coal. Chan chan chan. Chan chan chan. Chan chan chan. Chan chan chan. <laughs> no, it's something exploding. Oh, wait. Holy shit, the something's after us! Oh, it's, it's just throwing fireballs! What was that? Jeez, man. They did not give me equipment for this place. That was like a magical attack. Oh, it's coming back. Oh, that's, it's a little, yeah, it's that little thing. I don't know what that is, but it's like a, it's like a weird goat thing and it shoots fireballs off of its face. Okay, we can create salads while on the move. Oh no, it's another one of those. I don't like those. Oh, I don't like those. Oh, I don't like those. Oh, oh, we got away from it. Okay, so far I have learned that you need to just, if it moves, stay away from it. If it appears that it could be alive in some way, stay away from it. Because all we have is a zapper thing. Really have no idea what a good base location looks like, other than I'm sure it has something to do with water and iron nodes, but... What, what, what was that first thing I collected? Wasn't that... That was different. It had, like, a tall thing on it. All right, so, yeah, and see that cliff over there? That's got a bunch of, like, crystal-like looking things. Is that another iron node right there? That's got to be another iron node, right? No? What is that? It's sparkling. Anyways... Yeah, I feel like this is a good spot to build a base. It's getting dark anyway, so we might want to do that. I suppose we can always move. 
later, right? It's a survival... It's not really a survival game. It's like a crafting building game, but... Whoa! Okay, so there's the hub. That's red. It doesn't look like we can do that. Okay, well, we got a hub. That's a that's a home base. How do we... How do I... Close is escape or Q. Okay. Uh huh. Congratulations. Oh, wait, is coming hub to our rescue here. Craft ah, look at that. Hub it's a, feature, it's a vice. It's already used and worn. Complete hub upgrade one. Note the craft bench and hub terminal are essential for progression to the next objective. I figured as much. Um, yeah, so all of this came from that pod we landed in. This thing, it says, okay, the, complete the hub, complete the hub, complete the hub, select a tier, select a, miles, select a milestone, no schematic, there's nothing to do here, tier, tier zero, oh, oh, tier, oh, that's, a, okay, gotcha, zero is a tier, alright, so I have to, Hub upgrade one, that's our rewards. What do we need for hub upgrade? Oh, okay, we need, there it is, 10 probably rods. Okay, so, fine. 10 rods, can we make them? Easy. Tier zero, hub upgrade, click on that, click on that, select a milestone, we got it, Aha! Hub upgrade one, waiting for, res oh, do I have to, oh, I gotta put them in here, maybe. Ah, oh, ha, ha, gotcha. Right, upgrade the hub. It's even got a button for it. Look at that, sweet. All of this was packed into that tiny thing. Why didn't it just come upgraded? If Congratulations, you, know I mean? Jeez. you have unlocked building, workshop, equipment, portable miner, inventory, just... additional slots, hub feature, Whoa, personal look storage. At that. Oh, yeah. Okay, Sixth it's just objective. gifts Complete me with something two. out of the ethers. Portable miners require no power and will mine a node until their inventory is full. Ah! Note, multiple portable miners can be used on a single node. Uh-huh. So we need some plates. Give me some plates. Five, six. Okay, there we go. And I need more rods. How many rods was it? I'm not sure. Aha! We've got it! Uh, where do we put it? Are we supposed to put it in here somewhere? Not really sure. Let's put it off, like, over here. Yeah. Just kind of a charming little location there. Whoa! It's, it appears out of the ethers. Alright, cool. So... Um, so, right, right. So I need a portable miner. That costs... We, ha we just need a few... couple more iron plates. I might be able to do that. Iron plate. One, two. Sweet, we got it. Look at that. We hardly even mined and we can make all this stuff. Um, craft a portable miner. Oh. I gotta keep holding the button. <laughs> okay. Alright, there we go. So I think I took that and now I can... Production... Uh, no, I can do what? How do I... Uh, let's see, have the portable miner, do I put it in my hands? Oh, okay, so I could do that. Let's go find that iron node. Aha! Press... And... Uh... How do we put it down? Oh, there we go just the left click button and this guy is beginning to mine things and so he'll fill up his inventory and we'll have to come and collect it oh there he goes he's drilling in look at the concentration in his lights <laughs> I guess those are like eyes or something they have given it a personality oh look at those weird things over there oh man I should have built the base over there that area looks cool Maybe, maybe I can, I can actually build a base. It says, it said I can dismantle buildings without any loss of materials. Which is cool. Alright, so let me find out what these nodes are. See, that's what I mined 
Ah, oh, no, there's a dude next to it. Oh, there's a dude next to that one, too. Ah, oh, no. They're guarding these things. See, there's the render range right there. It's, it's got a... It's got a render range of very close. <laughs> that, that doesn't render in until I'm pretty much close to it. We'll see if we can do it again. We'll jump on top of the thing, zap them, and it should run away like the last time. Oh my god, he aggroed from that far away. No. Ooh. Get up here. Yes, no. No. Oh, he threw me up in the air. Yeah. Uh, crouch. Oh no. Dude, that guy looks weird. Look at that. Can I? No. <laughs> go away. Go away. There we go. There we go. Oh, man. Okay, so this is just another iron ore vein. Don't have that weird... Oh, look, there's a waterfall. We could have built the base over there. I think I'm going to have to move the base. Because um, look at all the cool areas around here. And uh, I don't know what all the nodes are. Don't know what all the possible nodes are, so, um, yeah, I don't know, for now, we'll just, um, we'll just, we'll just harvest more iron. And I think, yeah, but think, think we'll just move, yeah, before our inventories, you know, get too heavy and we're gonna, you know, make, make several trips, I think we'll just move now. All right, I've grabbed pretty much everything. I had to leave like a slug and some weeds behind, but look, there's another one of those things. What in the world is that? I'm gonna stay away from it for sure. <laughs> that is weird. I saw one of those like rag doll in one of the uh, uh, demo videos for the game, or what do you call it, trailers? Yeah, it was funny. <laughs> it just kind of rag dolled. But uh, yeah, I think I think somebody hit it with like a vehicle or something. <laughs> but yeah, okay. So we're moving base. It is uh, getting on the night time now. Um, I, I had to leave one of my little worms behind, but you know there seems to be quite a few of them. Oh, there's like an area with trees over there. That's kind of interesting. I think I want to go over there though. That looks pretty cool. So that's where we're headed. What in the world are those? What is that? Oh, that's copper ore vein. Oh, somebody's angry. What is that? S A M ore. That looks valuable. Aha! Uh -huh. Yeah. So yeah, right, right here. Yeah, I forgot about water, but uh, I seen this water, and then I remembered water is probably important. So. Oh, that's cool. There's like a thing up here. It's a bit far from the water though. There's like another crash site up there. There doesn't seem to be tons of resources in these rocks though, so... I mean, there was that one weird thing that we couldn't pick up that looked valuable. So I'm gonna go around the lake area, kind of over towards there and see... Uh, there's maybe a more open area there and there's another biome there, which... Might uh, levy some more uh, resources. You know, having a having a decent you know uh, array of veins nearby that we can just constantly mine. Yeah, that's gonna be good. Through the night on a strange alien world. Come on. Oh, what's? Oh, I don't have a character name, do I? Whatever your name is, run. Press E to pet the lizard doggo. Did I do it? Oh, we just run away. I was pressing E. No, don't run away, lizard doggo. Man, there's just like no mining nodes around here. There's just nothing to mine. Am I like missing something? Is there like only mining on that one like half of the map or something? All right, we're entering the broccoli forest. Ah. Come on, why can't I get him? Dude, he's right there. Ah. There we go, there we go. He's on the run. 
I make a break. Oh, where did he come from? I just run across some birds here. I think. That's new. What is the other movement? Is that... It's these things moving around. Look at those birds. Can't do anything with them. Okay. Well... Best not to make enemies. <laughs> Could zap him, but... Last time I zapped something, I made an enemy. Whoa, look at this place. This is cool. It's like... Oh. Whoa, whoa, those guys were not there before. What in the world? Whoa, they're after me. Ooh. Ooh, there's more up here. Oh my god. Ooh. Oh, those guys just spawned. They just spawned. Did you see that? They were not there before. I just went through that area and they just spawned there. There's like a cave. Yeah, there's one of those. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. It's hard to go around looking for a spot for your base, man. And is that a stream over there? Yeah, and we'll probably... Um... Ooh. Aha! Yeah, I don't really know about fall damage in this game. Oh, and there's, it's just little doggy, lizard doggy in there. Okay, can I make this jump? Huh. Oh, I didn't. Yeah, that damage. Oh, I lost some health, but... So there's definitely fall damage. Um, I jumped from that high, and it wasn't terrible, but... But that scared me. Oh, no, it's not iron. It's Caterium Ore. But I think that's the first time I've ever seen a Caterium Ore node. Like, like one I can drop my stuff on. What are those? Are these gonna explode and damage me too? Ooh! Yes! That's the ones that we saw before! No! Oh, Jeez, man, it wasn't even close! Jump, jump, jump! Oh, I think they're still on me. No, there's more up there! No! Oh. Okay, we're gonna have to fight. Gonna have to fight. Do it! Do it! Oh! Yeah, we got one! Come on! We stunned him! Yes! Punch! Finisher! Oh, now we're down to half health. The stupid things, man. It's fr oh. Bees, man. Not the bees. Give me some Mountain Dew. This is a nice looking place here. Oh, that, oh, that guy just spawned. He like fell from the air. He like spawned in like sometimes things do in... Oh, what? Whoa, 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 that guy was not there before! Oh, what in the world? Why can't I get it? Uh. Come over here, maybe. That might be a better spot. Ooh. Oh, we got him, we got him. No? He's not He's not going to take the bait this time, huh? Ah. Uh, can I just shock this guy to death? Ah, oh, jeez, man. There we go. Punch! Yes. Oh, we got him! Not enough space for alien carapace. Dude, he flew out of his own carapace. Oh, he's disappeared. Alien carapace. Maybe I should st start in that area before. Maybe iron only exists in that one area? Well, this is a pretty area here. I wouldn't mind living here if, uh, if we could find some... Oh, no! Oh, there's more things coming after me! Ooh, yeah. No, no, no! Oh, there's more! Where are they coming from? Uh. Oh! Ooh, yeah. Oh! I don't think we're gonna survive this one. Whoa, something is exploding right there. Oh, there's just, they're just everywhere around here. Everywhere you go, they just spawn next to you. 
Come on. And they're, 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 they're faster than I am, apparently. Definitely for sure. Are we not being attacked anymore? Oh. Let's start fighting the other guys or something. Okay. We gotta be more careful, but I don't know. I just feel like they're being spawned around us. Alright, I see some nodes over there. So it looks safe. I'm gonna go over here and check these nodes out. Oh, we found iron again. Just no water. And this one is, uh... More iron. Oh, there's one of those guys. Oh, two of those guys. Oh, they're both after me. Oh, why? We're gonna have to lead them off this cliff or... Wait, where'd they go? Oh, we... Oh, they exited render range. Okay, we're gonna have to... Oh, they went back. All right, I don't know. Well, we don't, we haven't needed water yet, so. Oh, man. Um, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna base up right here. I'm gonna shack up right here. All right, yeah, this looks like a good spot. Let's choose this one here. Nothing is around here. Okay, get me the hub. All right, there we go. It's, it's kind of weird. As long as you have the materials to, to to make a workshop, you can just open up the menu and go, workshop here. And all those materials just magically turn into a workshop. That's cool. It's kind of magic. Nice. There we go. And let me go put my, um... We'll go put these things... Yeah, on our little nodes. That'll be cool. Oh, check it out. I also found a crude oil mark here. Oh, that's a lot of crude oil. All right. Well, that's cool. That's a new resource we haven't seen yet. All right, guys. I think I'm going to end the episode there. That's pretty cool. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. What in the world? Oh, those big ones, I think, are different than the small ones. Dude. Dude. Okay, well, <laughs> oh man, these guys are crazy. Wow. All right, so yeah, I think uh, I think this is a pretty good base spot. Um, I don't know. Uh, does anybody know? Uh, is this a good base spot? Put it in the comments below. <laughs> it might not be a good base spot. I don't know. There's no water around here. I thought that oil might be water, but no, it was, it was oil. Anyways. Thanks a lot for watching if you enjoyed the episode and if you want to see more of this series do indeed smack that like button right in the cutie patootie for me and for us all and for the like button. The like button enjoys that way much. Alright, <laughs> uh, this episode is kind of long so you guys I'll see you in the next one and oh by the way I am I'm quite liking this game. I think I'm going to make another episode uh, maybe later today. <laughs> Uh, that would be cool. Uh, oh, 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 there's another one of those rare things with another one of those explody things. Many bad things around, but it's a really beautiful game. I mean, look at this. Really beautiful game. And uh, seems pretty interesting. I'm, I definitely want to crack on and see what else uh, we can do in this game. I think of, we're only scratching the surface here. So, uh, yeah. Until next time. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.